Hello there, welcome to Passiveburn. In this video, I am going to review Chat ABC, which is a collaborative platform where you can use your own OpenAI API key and then you can write unlimited amount of words. You do not have to go to ChatGPT and uh, it will save you a lot of money from your wallet, I think, because uh, OpenAI API key is much cheaper than uh, ChatGPT. And see, they are saying that Chat ABC adds collaboration features to ChatGPT, including pre-made prompts, document support, and shared access from a single account. They're running their lifetime deal on AppSumo, and license share one pricing is 39 USD. Here you can add three team members, but in license share two, you can add up to 25 team members. And in both um, tiers, you will get custom domain and branding. So you can white level this platform completely, actually. Hope you get idea now. Without further ado, let's go to the dashboard of chat abc here see this is the dashboard of chat abc what do you have to do at first you have to click on this enter open ai api key and here you have to insert the open ai api key now how will you get this open ai api key you have to just um, go to the platform.openai.com forward slash account forward slash api keys this url and from here you have to create your secret api key so let me create one and here the name let's say the name is uh, chat abc um, demo chat abc demo and then i'll just click on this create and then i will copy this api key and then i will go to chat abc and then i'll just paste this api key here and then click on this save api key and then guys you are good to go and from here we can select our language model which language model we can uh, use fast and effective chat gpt uh, 3.5 turbo and then gpt 3.5 turbo 16k by open ai also they have gpt 4 gpt4 advanced so these are the things now let's say i will use this one and then now um, we can ask anything let's say i will ask oh, what is uh, google let's say i will ask what is google and then let's see what it provides us so yes here this is the writing actually and we can edit it as you can see from here we can update this message also uh, we can here okay no edit okay let me cancel we can copy this message from here we can regenerate it also from here see guys it's regenerating and we can stop the uh, generation we can share it from here shareable link will be copied and then you can share it and then let's say i will ask maybe um, write the history of maybe india from from let's say 1855 to today and then let's see what it uh, provides us see guys uh, they have written this story and the story is very lengthy as you can see the um, the story is lengthy that i have expected so these are the things actually hope you get idea and in this way you can chat uh, here and you can create different folder as you can see here this is one folder i have created see engineering folder marketing chat folder to create new folder just click here create folder and then let's say the folder name is uh, video folder and then click on create folder and then see guys, this video folder which has been created and all your chat will be uh, saved here as you can see the chat has been saved here you can create new conversation from here just click here on this plus icon and then new conversation will be created and then I will ask let's say maybe i can ask here let's say give me give me top five um, time saving strategy uh, so that so that i can uh, work less and then let's see what it provides us so here it's providing us and see one new uh, chat has been created here see here i hope you can see here here under this marketing team chat folder they have two uh, new chats actually hope you get idea but it's not the end there have more features see there have output language you can select on which language you want the output as you can see there have a lots of language guys you can select your language let's say here i will select maybe another language that i don't know also let's say i will select here a spinal and then tone let's say the tone will be uh, let's say uh, for formal or it can be emotional i think and writing style let's say academic analytical then conversational creative critical then um, ep epistolary 
then expository, then informative. So a lot of writing styles are available here. Let's say I'll write here maybe uh, informative and format. See, they have different format, concise, step by step, then extreme detail, story, poem, song. So I'll select, let's say, extreme detail. And then I will ask the same question, not same question. Let's say I will ask, um, um, tell, uh, tell me the history of India from, let's say, from... Uh, from 1645 to today and then let's see what it provides us and see guys now it's providing me the answer but the answer is in spanol so in this way you can select your um, expected language and it will uh, answer you to your language actually also it will um, you can select the tone of voice you can select the format etc etc from here Hope you get idea these features you will not get in chat gpt i think so these are the things and then there have voice search feature let's say i will ask here here we have to select the um okay we have to give access let me here change these things now if i click here we have to allow our microphone now here see here okay it have written let me change the language from here let's say i'll select here english and then from here i'll change everything to default so that i get the generic uh, result actually so uh, here default and now i will ask what is the uh, capital city of okay um, but the bad thing i am seeing here, here is before stopping my uh, talking it's getting the answer actually so let me ask here again what is the capital city of India? See guys, here uh, it's um, detecting my voice actually. That's really great guys. Hope you get idea guys. So these are the things actually here in this way you can chat. But it's not the in there have more. There have library as you can see. Here there have some prompt. As you can see here there have a lots of prompt. There have content or SEO prompt. There have email marketing prompt. There have paid ads prompt. And then there have PR or communication prompt. Sales prompt act as prompt let's say act as an excel sheet expert act as english translator and improver or act as english pronunciation helper so in this way there have a lots of uh, prompts actually but if you want you can create your custom prompt also here just click here create custom prompt and here give a name of the custom uh, prompt let's say reward one and here is the description so that you can understand later what this um, prompt is about let's say i'll write here this is a demo prompt and uh, let's say here yes uh, prompt and then here prompt let's say the prompt will be write a step by step blog article about beginner's guide of email marketing it's a uh, demo prompt actually but in your case you have to write your detailed prompt here hope you get idea and after that just click here on this create prompt this prompt will be created here now let's say i will run this prompt so let me um, change my folder let's say i will write it under this engineering folder so i'll just click here on this library and from here if i just click here on this reward one and then if i just click here on this use prompt then automatically this prompt will be added here and then if i just enter then let's see what it provides us So here, these are the things actually. See here, uh, it's writing our content. So in this way, you can use their library also. Also, they have a lots of uh, amazing public library. You can use this prompt also if you want. Let's say I will use one of their SEO content um, prompt here. Let's say maybe a step-by-step -step guide or let's say short summary, FAQ generator. Okay, let's say I will use this one. So just click here and then create a list of uh, let's say 10 frequently asked yes 10 frequently asked question let's say 10 frequently asked question about let's say about email marketing about email marketing and provide answer for each one of them considering the sharp and rich result guidance and then if i just enter then see it will provide us the answer actually hope you get idea guys how it will work so here it's providing us 10 FAQ.
so these are the things of you get idea these are the things that you will get here after that they have some settings if i go to the setting section from here you can they have general um, setting you can change the workspace name you can change, change the workspace url and then workspace de description avatar that means you can white label uh, it you can use my branding that means uh, use my branding higher and logo higher possible okay uh, so in this way you can white label these things actually and then they have people option from here you can add your team members and then they have domain you can also add here your custom domain here guys see this will be custom domain associated with your workspace let's say i will add one let's say i will add maybe chat chat dot com and then if i just click here on this add then let's see what uh, happened uh, see they are um, here giving us uh, some um, guideline actually to configure your subdomain set this following c name uh, record on your dns provider to continue so what do you have to do you have to just go to the uh, c name or you have to just go to the dns section of your uh, domain and then you have to insert this information on the dns section and then this domain will be added with this platform actually and then it will be completely white label people will not see this chat abc.ai people will see here your own domain and then if you want uh, to change the open api key you can change your open api key from here that have the uh, embedding option that means open ai embedding model you can see the model from here then they have vector db uh, type selective vector database type for your orchestras only one is available but i'm not sure very much about these things actually and then the last option is billing but if you get the lifetime deal then you do not have to worry about this billing actually hope you get idea so these are the things that you will get inside this chat abc if you think as you need this type of software for your business or for your personal growth then you can get this chat abc lifetime deal from appsumo i'll give the url of this chat abc lifetime deal in the description of this video just go to the description of this video and get the 10 percent discount on this chat abc lifetime deal it's an affiliate link as if you use this link to purchase this amazing deal i'll get a small commission without costing you any additional money so if you think guys this video is helpful for you then please consider using this link to purchase this amazing deal and the last thing is visit our website www.pc1.com to get more tips and tricks about growing online business also join our vip lifetime deal discussion group through the description of this video and if you haven't subscribed to this youtube channel yet guys then please consider subscribing this channel thanks again for watching this video